Hi, I'm Seth Marion from Doc Dot Shop, and I'm here with Roy, a friend of mine, and he'd like to put a nature trail across his brook. Our sections are 10 feet long. They're going to have perforated decking that'll allow the, the grass and everything to stay alive underneath. You can start your project by using sawhorses indoors. Follow the plans on our website, doc.shop. There you can find 4x10s, 6x8s. These are sizes that you can carry by hand with a friend. Once the frames are built, you can stack them on a trailer. Haul them to the location and mount the hardware in the field. The 4x4 post brackets easily mount to the side of your dock frame for holding your 4x4 post legs. The post legs need to be finish cut in order to fit inside the two plates that work as a clamp. Simply use the bracket itself as your template for drilling two holes 3 8 diameter. Two and a half inch carriage bolts 3 8 will fit in these holes. It sure makes it easy to have a hook when joining sections together. The J bracket bolts to the end of one section, so when you bring your next section out, you just hook it on and bolt it together. It's important to keep your strong friends close by. They've mounted all the hardware and it's ready for installation. Oh, wouldn't it be great if they made pencil sharpeners this big? Well, they don't. So here's a way you can cut using a skill saw to sharpen the end of your posts. So this is called a 4x4 post driving cap. We're going to use this to sink the 4x4s into the ground. Okay. The deeper we get them, the more holding power they have and the more stable they are. Structurally sound. That's how we do it. Depending on the hardness of the soil, it might seem a bit exhausting trying to drive all these posts into the ground. It's a good workout, however, it's good to have a group of friends that can rotate taking turns so others can take a break. Good, good. So over here we've got a rock. This post isn't going to get driven into the ground. It's going to use this aluminum foot and it's going to sit on top. Now take a look how easy it is to mount these 4x4s to the side of your dock frame and you can adjust the height. All you gotta do is rest the next section on these hooks yep. and that one gets two legs and two hooks. The next one gets two legs and two hooks and so on. Sounds good. You can now access your land on the other yeah. side. Yep. Everybody can enjoy it now. Looking forward to a lot of use out of this. This is great. Well, hope you enjoy it. Thanks. Thanks a lot. You're Good welcome. Job. Let's go build some more. Oh, Roy, well, you said it was somewhere over here you wanted to go with this? Yeah. Yep, that'll work. 